I'm looking at an iceberg right in front of where I plan to be paddling north of here. I'm going to take you on a trip to see the flowers, the geology, and the icebergs in the ice fjord. I'm going to be your narrator. This is Gail Ferris. This is Manitak Island I'm looking at. I'm on the northeast side of Manitak Island and this area has lots of desirable places where one can pull in for a campsite. I'm heading down this fjord, which winds around to the west, eventually. And it is interesting. The geology. A couple of nights ago, I camped on the opposite side. Now I am coming around the north side of Minnesota Island after the iceberg is Pugata Island where I stayed the first couple of nights I'd come around the corner on the back side of Pugata Island and this is a horseshoe shaped bay. A couple of icebergs I crossed in. This series of still shots shows you how a northern fulmar flies. It's quite different than an ordinary seagull, which makes it unique. These are northern fulmar, which feed specifically around icebergs. They eat marine invertebrates. When the wind is blowing and the waves are churned up, they will come quite close to my kayak, unfortunately, when it's too choppy to use my video camera. These birds look in color like gulls, but their wings are very different and the shape of their head is very different. They're not a type of gull and they feed very differently than gulls. I paddled about 20 miles today. The tide and the current were against me in the last few miles. It's now about 11.15. This Anderson's Hope. The mountain off of Opernovic. And the mountains on... These mount mountains are on the Danube. This is the reflected sunlight. I thought you would enjoy it. My boat is safely up, nice and high. On a bright, calm day, I'm leaving Sisuargasut Island, heading across for four miles, and I have to take into consideration the iceberg densities. And the icebergs are collected in between the passages. Some of them are really quite sizable. However, the minerals in this area are so colorful because they are iron and calcium interlaced together. I'm heading west and I'm approaching a low-lying Atosovic Island among other islands that are also low-lying. We're looking at Nayat to the north and these are large icebergs that have come from Greece Fjord. This iceberg looks like it's three to five stories tall, the tallest I have seen yet on the water. 
there they are collected to the west in Baffin Bay and this is iron in the Inarsuit area. It's right near Inarsuit and it's a nice place to be. This fjord wraps around and comes on the other side as a U shape. Looking out, it's 6 o'clock in the evening, and these ripples on the water represent air currents circulating around that are a product of sun angle, sun intensity, and circulation in and out of the fjords from the outside and from the glacier on the inside. Yesterday I experienced about 10 to 12 knots of wind. So I'm preparing to load up my boat and roll it off of this ramp. Thanks for watching my video. Gail Ferris, your videographer and narrator.